Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Trisha Creative Minds Creations. And today I'm going to start with sharing with you um, another collaboration that's going on in my group at Craft and Manipulators. And it is called the Thrift Store Makeover or Upcycling Collaboration where we have to uh, refurbish or upcycle, makeover, whatever, um, a particular device, or not device, item every week for the next five weeks so the first week we had to do was a frame and so i'm going to be sharing with it to you this week and um this is what i come up with okay so this is what i done with the frame okay so wait a minute this turn on goes this way because it's going to be setting up like this i'll say so yeah so this is my frame that i did now um give me a minute um, well, not a minute, but a hot second. I'm going to show you what the frame looked like before I painted it um, and then after I painted it. So, here you go. Okay, so now this is what it looks like after I you know, did it, you know, remade it. And what I did was if you... When you seen in the first picture of the pictures that I just showed you, it, the frame was already gold when I got it, okay? But I didn't like the gold. There was a, I mean, it was going to get covered up anyway with the paint that I put on it. Um, but I did put a, another uh, coat of spray paint on there, gold spray paint. I let it dry completely. And then I did the crackle paint thing. Now, I don't have any crackle medium. I never bought it. And I have done this before, but I did it with just regular white glue and it's that and I, and I got this and I use glue that I got from Dollar Tree you know regular right PVC glue guys and you what you do is you put a uh, a thin or maybe a thick coat of the glue on your piece and then before it dries I mean because it's a it's a fairly thick layer uh, even layer at that so while that's still wet do you have to take your color paint whatever paint you want to and you have to color I mean paint it uh, on top of that glue Okay, then once it dry, or it starts to dry, it starts to crackle like this. Now, of course, I didn't wait for it to dry on its own. I used my heat gun and I, you know, let it dry and then it did the crackling effect. Now, I used like an off-white paint, but for some reason it's got a green tint to it. I don't know, that's never happened to me before. Because I've used uh, green, I mean white paint over, um, over gold spray paint. Well, actually, it wasn't spray paint, it was actually acrylic paint. So that's probably what, what why it turned got a little green tint to it. Well, no biggie because it works out. So anyway, that's what I did to get the crackling effect on it, and then um, I wanted to bling it up. I mean, I, I, I guess you do see a lot of blinged up frames, but I wanted to bling this one up. So I put some of the bling around the edges, and I was not sure about this bling in the middle, but once I added, it, I like I like it. And so I put uh, right here and with a flourish uh, edges, I put some little sequins and the sequins is kind of like a holographic uh, thing to it. So, it, you know, it kind of changes color. So I like that. And then I put uh, like a little, a few of my paper, red flipper flowers right down here in the corner. Now it can go this way. The frame can be set up this way or this way. I think I get framed that way. Or that way and it can go like that or you can hang it on the wall this is the back of it the, what the back looks like now I did have to get my some of my, uh, my, my acrylic paint pen I had to go over some because I did make a mistake and get some of the white on there and I didn't want that being messy so I did get uh, my black acrylic paint pen and go over that to fix that so this is the back looks like oh and by the way this frame only cost me a dollar at the thrift store there was no price limit on what we had to spend at the thrift store we just had to get a specific item so like i said this week we had to do a frame next week it'll be something else i'm going to tell you what that is you got to come back and see what that is but anyway so this is what i got for this week and um i hope uh my partner likes it because uh when we get finished with this collaboration we're going to have partners i'm going to be sending this and my other items that we're going to be making for the next four weeks to a partner and they're going to send me you know whatever they make so this is what i come up with this day and i like it i hate to give it away because this is really pretty i have to go buy from the find another frame with some you know something sitting like this and make me one but um here you go guys i hope you like y'all have a crafty day and see you next later next week bye